Welcome to your Flame Fundamentals training. Let's look at two other editorial functions known as lifting and extracting. This either leaves a gap in the sequence or closes it depending on which operation you're using. These are common practices when refining an edit but you might know them by slightly different names. Now to lift or extract a selection of segments from the sequence you can either select the segments or use the IN and OUT markers. For selection, you can hold CONTROL and click on multiple segments. The LIFT or EXTRACT will only target the selection and leave other tracks alone. If you want to select all the tracks using the positioner, hold CONTROL and drag the positioner from the START to the end of the selection. Alternatively, if you are someone who prefers to mark up your segments to lift or extract, just use the IN and OUT markers and this will act the same as selecting all the tracks. Please note that using the markers for lift or extract will only work with the keyboard shortcuts and not the gestural method. If at any point you don't want a track to be included in the selection, just use the track lock to prevent any changes. When you lift a selection of segments from a sequence, you are simply deleting it. The big difference between lift and extract is that lift does not ripple the sequence. So to gesturally lift the selection, ensure ripple is off and click and drag the selection to the bottom of the screen. This lifts and deletes the selection at the same time. I'll undo that operation and repeat the lift with the keyboard shortcut. Ensuring the selection has been made, press OPTION L to lift the selection. This performs the same lift as the gestural method but you don't need to worry whether ripple is on or off. All that's left are gap segments and you can fill them up with whatever you want. When you extract a segment from a sequence, you are also deleting it. The big difference between LIFT and EXTRACT is that EXTRACT will ripple the sequence. So to gesturally extract the selection, ensure RIPPLE is ON and click and drag the selection to the bottom of the screen. This extracts and deletes the selection at the same time. The latter segments in the sequence ripple back and close the gap. I'll undo that operation and repeat the extract with the keyboard shortcut. Now you should have noticed that the original selection did not include any existing gap segments in the sequence. This caused the extraction to knock the sequence out of sync. As a tip, you can enable the selection to include the gaps via the Timeline Options pull down menu and the next selection will include everything. Press SHIFT BACKSPACE to extract the selection. This performs the same extract as the gestural method but once again, you don't need to worry whether ripple is on or off. All the holes left by the extraction have been closed and the sequence is slightly shorter. Please move on to the next video and don't forget to like and subscribe to the Flame Learning Channel. Thanks for watching.